Hey guys, welcome back to Casa Sicily Unboxings. Today I am doing my most punctual box, which is the single swag. Um, this is October 2020. This is my fourth box. I do have a six month subscription. I do not think I will be renewing it though. Um, cause I have so many other, um, subscription boxes and I haven't been super impressed. I, I just think like, my videos are really snarky and stuff and I, and I, you know, we'll see what happens in this box and I, it's weird cause I'm always excited to get it, but at the same time, I'm like ready for an eye roll with the pricing and the values they assign to everything in the box. Um, so we'll see. Maybe I'll miss that. You know, I'll miss, I'll miss having my little come on moment, you know, so we'll see. But, um, it does feel a little light. It feels a little light. So I don't know what's going on with single swag. Maybe they got mad at everybody complaining and we're like, you know, I'm going to show you lesser value. Um, but this is the box. Um, it always is the same. You know, you have to hand it to them. They basically, they have their formula. They give you the same box. They give you the same car. They give you the same type of um, products. Um, you got your makeup, you got your skincare, you got your snack, you got your accessory, um, a jewelry, and then like uh, maybe a book or something like that. So we'll see. Okay. So my favorite thing to do right off the bat is always check this number down here. This is where it tells you everything that's in the box, the value for everything. And it is always, but always like 200, 202, 204, 206. And it's like, come on, really every single time. Like that's why it's a little bit like annoying, but let's see. So we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight eight items so let's check it out all right so here we're starting with the box um it looks like this looks like maybe some sort of towel so let's see this is a uh, non-slip headbands i feel like no ah this is the ivy this is ivy olivia Ivy Olivia towel wrap, towel wrap. Okay, I have a few of these. Um, I have to say this one is like the most fleecy of all the ones I've ever gotten because uh, all the other ones I've had feel more like a towel. This feels like like a like a fleeced hoodie, you know. So that's kind of different for this type of uh, wrap. So it says microfiber hair towel wrap. This luxurious soft microfiber hair towel wrap will provide comfort during your post shower routine and is gentle on your skin and hair, accommodates all hair lengths, machine wash cold, no bleach, hang to dry. This has a value of $24. Um, I don't know. I never went to buy one of these because I keep getting them at subscription boxes, so I haven't had to buy one, but um, $24 sounds a little steep, but you know, I don't have a super, super uh, gripe with that particular price right now. So micro, mi microfiber hair towels are always um, useful, always good. Uh, I did like the design, super cute. I like that, um, uh, whatever this little design is called, I'm forgetting right now, but it's like the Charlie Brown uh, little design. And um, I'm, I'm down, you know, it was a little fleecy compared to other ones I've tried, but I won't not use it. You know, I'll definitely use it. Um, okay, now we have a Gen 3 Stars in Your Eyes bracelet. Okay, now I'm gonna get annoyed because um, this is our jewelry and we got a bracelet last month. And this box is not like other subscription boxes. I'm pretty sure this box gives every single subscriber the exact same thing. So for them to put a bracelet two months in a row is a little lazy. And it's annoying to me because I don't really like bracelets that much. Um, this is what it looks like because my, my, um, my wrists are fair, are, are large and bracelets don't, um, don't usually fit me that well. So you see, this looks so tiny. I mean, it's cute. It's pretty. It looks nice against my skin, but um, it does have an extender. 
but I don't think that's going to be enough and I'm not going to try to mess with it. But this is actually, it's cute. It has little stars and a moon and everything. So the design is super cute, but is it useful jewelry to me? Not really. And the, um, and the fact that it's a second bracelet in two months is a little bit annoying, uh, because, um, like I said, I feel like every, every single subscriber gets the exact same thing. So it's not like, oh, you know, too bad. Your variation didn't really, you know, give you what you wanted, but all right. And then my biggest gripe is usually on the jewelry with the, um, with the value assigned to the jewelry is usually, um, like exorbitantly out of the scope of reality. So let's see what it says here. This says, um, yes, Gen 3, the Mila Zodiac. Oh, it's a Zodiac charm. Okay. I like Zodiac stuff, but Zodiac charm bracelet. Thank your lucky stars for yourself in this chic charm bracelet with a seven inch chain and two inch extender with a, with a bolo clasp wear it. Okay. $58. I don't think my camera is even like, what? I can't focus. $58, $58. It's just, you're losing me. You're losing me. I can't anymore with this. It's just stop. Stop. It's not necessary. Okay. Ay, ay, ay see what we have here we have lip syrup high shine pigmented lip stain okay I like that idea because I I'm down with the lip stains right now an ultra rich long-lasting glossy lip stain made with sweet pearl coated pigments that cover your palate in an enticing luster infused with a scrumptious blend of sugar maple and van vanilla bean extracts to help hydrate and mend and chapped lips that sounds really yummy actually so let's see what we have going on here this has a value of $12. Ooh, that's a bold red. That is a bold red. And I thought so. When it said, oh my gosh, oh my gosh, who fell asleep at single swag? That's what I want to know. I want to know who fell asleep at single swag. Because as soon as I read sugar maple and vanilla bean, I thought to myself, that sounds kind of Christmassy, you know? That sounds kind of like not the right season. What is this? Christmas decorations. This is a Christmas product. This is a Christmas product, Trifle Cosmetics. I mean, unless they sell Christmas lip gloss year round, this brand, which I never heard of, this is really just egregious. This is just you're just sending out the wrong season. Don't even care. I mean, this would be super cute if it was like October, like if it was a Halloween, um, Halloween themed lip product, then it would be like, oh, cool. You know, but this really Christmas, Christmas in October. Well, it's not the worst thing that happened in 2020. So I guess, and here you have it. All right, it's red like a candy cane for Christmas. $12, okay. Not happy. Okay, so next up is the headbands. Okay, this is, a, um, this is something I think they've given before. I haven't gotten anything yet. For, this is only my fourth box, and I did receive um, a scarf from the um, the same brand. I think it says. Um, oh no, sorry, I'm wrong. I, I'm totally wrong. This is um, not from the same company that did the the scarf before. It was like Headbands for Hope. This is not that. This is a different brand altogether. It's called. Ma Mavi Bands Adjustable Non-Slip Headband. This stylish adjustable headband has an elastic back and non-slip technology on the inside to ensure a perfect fit that will stay in place all day long. This is $18. I don't know that we need all of this down back here. Like who needs all of this? 
I mean, if you're, if you really are committed to your headband and you got to have a perfect fit, I guess that makes sense to have like the adjustable business in the back. But to me, it's just, and that's it. Like, I don't really, I don't think I've ever actually wanted one that went all the way around. I usually just, I don't know. I'm not a big headband person, so maybe that's why I'm not too in the know. But, I mean, it's a cute little design. I do like that. And I'll definitely try it. I'm not knocking it, you know. It could be really cool. Sometimes I do wish I had a headband um, on hand, so I'm not upset to have received it. Um, it just seems like an overly complicated product uh, for what it is. Okay, next up we have Steve Laurent Tweezer Duo. Okay, so here's some um, beauty tools. So this says, Lux Tweezer Duo, say goodbye to pesky stray hairs with, oh, I thought it said pesky gray hairs. I was like, what? Well, um, with this set of two stainless steel tweezers, one slant tip and one pointed tip, durable, easy to clean and perfectly calibrated tension for more control and a stress-free tweezing ritual. This is $24. I recognize the brand name, but I think this brand has also had a lot of, um, blowback i think for either knockoffs or something um so it's not the most um esteemed uh brand and um this is the one one tweezer here i mean you know tweezers are cool like you can't have i, I have a bunch of them but um having another one is fine uh <laughs> it's like chopsticks <laughs> Um, and it does have the Steve Laurent, um, name on here, but it's not like embossed or anything. It's just, I think it's just printed on. Um, so it's not, it's not screaming like super luxury. Now, I don't know how much these tools usually cost at the store, but I wouldn't spend $24 on this, but you know, I, I can't, I don't know when I last bought uh, a tweezer set because I have gotten a few in like makeup boxes and things so I don't really know what the going value for these are this one also has the Steve Laurent name on it there but again it's not like embossed or anything just sort of printed on um but you know these are tools and I do appreciate uh receiving tools um over products sometimes because I have so much face like face cleansers and moisturizers and things like that so whenever I get a tool instead, I'm I'm grateful because you know I feel like I can use that more. Um, and then we have the U and Oil Acai Fig Marula Antioxidants Antioxidants Complex. This is um, U and Oil Face Serum, the super effective 100% natural and organic face serum enriched with superfoods, vitamins, and minerals, is designed to nourish, hydrate, and protect your skin while boosting skin firmness, density, and volume. So this is a $44 value. I never heard of the brand before, but I'm, I like the, I like the bottle. This is cute. Ooh, it was like totally sealed. Oh, I wanna smell it. Ooh, it smells nice. I like the smell. Okay, hold on, I wanna try. I wanna try a little bit. I received a couple of serums so far this season, I feel like it's definitely, Oh, it smells really nice. It smells a little bit like vitamin E, which is a bland kind of um, scent. Um, yeah, it smells nice. It's just very, you can see a shiny, never mind the, uh, the very annoying uh, <laughs> Christmas lip gloss that I just can't stand right now. But um, this, this serum just, it's nice, it's, it's light. And, um, and I, and I could see it doing the job, you know, and I, and like I said, I've received a couple of serums now, so I'll definitely, um, see where this one fits in, but it's nice to have them because I, I do plan to incorporate them into my beauty routine, um, on the daily. And I have a feeling that they will, you know, go pretty quick once I start doing that. Um, then I have the Spongel Black Orchid Body Wash Infused Buffer. I feel like I already have this. I don't know if I received it from Single Swag or FabFitFun, um, but Spongel is kind of like a very favorite um, brand for all these subscription boxes. You get all kinds of different um, 
uh, sponges from this brand. Um, so it's a recognizable brand anyway. And it says body wash infused buffer. It's a $20 value. Love your skin with this body wash infused buffer designed to cleanse, moisturize, rejuvenate, and restore every inch of your body. This product is dermatologist, uh, dermatologist tested, vegan, cruelty free, and made with love in the USA, which is nice to hear. Um, and let's take a quick look. I think it's shaped like an orchid or something. Yeah, like a little flower. So here it is. Yep. So this is always good to have. I don't, I don't mind getting repeats of stuff like this because they are super useful. Um, so I'm happy with that. And then the last thing is the, um, uh, I think this is the last thing. It says birds, famous cookies, birds. Fam I was wondering, I was like, where's that freaking snack? Okay. Birds, famous cookies, postcard pack. Indulge in these delectable bite-sized award-winning cookies baked in small batches in Savannah, Georgia in the U S and this box is a $4 value. Um, I, I like the sound of that. That's kind of cute. Little cookies. There seems to be only a few in here. You know what? This is giving me this, um, this kind of like whatever this material is called. It's like when you get, um, when you get those holiday uh, gift bo boxes, you know, like the big with like a bunch of different items and then they just put it and then like each little box has one of those, um, metallic uh you know foils or whatever and then it's like three cookies inside and that's you know part of the big um the big setup and it, it's just a little wasteful so this huge box i swear to god the cookies are down here <laughs> i don't really know hopefully they taste good lemon lemons a, a fun flavor for cookies so you know i don't think these are vegan though I don't, it says Contains wheat, egg, and milk. So definitely not sharing with my husband. He's a vegan. Um, so there's that. Okay. So we got we went through the box. Um, really nothing impressed me at all. Um, it was nice to see the sponge gel. The serum seems okay. Um, the lip, the lip oil thing, Aside from being the wrong season, it's also like super, super red. I don't know that I would be able to pull that off. Um, so I don't know. The bracelet I'm disappointed about because I, I don't usually use bracelets that much and to get two in a row, just annoying. Um, and the headband is kind of cool. I'll definitely check that out. Um, that might prove to be useful. Um, and then the head towel, I, I'm sure will be useful. So that's good. But yeah, I'm sad to say, so this is my fourth box and um, I'm waiting on a fifth and a sixth and then I think that's it for me in single swag because I'm just not impressed, you know. I, I feel like it's very formulaic and um, not too much imagination when it comes to the curation and then the situation with the overvaluation of the products is also like really disappointing. So. Um, I can't say recommend the subscription. It's, it's cool if you just want to give it a try, but definitely look for, um, coupons cause they definitely have coupon codes out there regularly where you can get a discount on, you know, whatever subscription, um, you decide to go with. But, um, you know, I, I got it on a steep discount. I did a six month subscription with 40% off and, um, so I feel okay with it because I ended up paying less than $30 for the box, but I think they, the box itself is like 40 bucks. And honestly, for 40 bucks to receive this box, I would have been really annoyed and, um, not, not looking forward to continuing. So anyway, uh, make sure you subscribe and comment below. Let me know what your thoughts are with single swag. If you still enjoy them, if you feel the same way, whatever it is, I know they have another brand. They have another box that came out the same people they even print the exact same box so funny i mean the exact same card and it's called paradise delivered i have not tried that i don't think i will because it looks like it's exactly the same as this and um i don't think you get repeat items but i wouldn't trust it so anyway thanks for joining me talk to you soon and i will see you with my next unboxing very soon bye